Hello and welcome back to uh, the Misadventures of Sloan Part 3, I believe. So last stream, um, I'm trying to remember what happened last stream. We moved in a neighbor. Um, he doesn't really like us that much. Our intentions were to make him like us and fall in love with him. But guess that didn't work out very well. If you want to see that stream, um, it should be on my channel. Um, it might still be there. And then I also upload things to YouTube as well. Um, yeah, so basically we've got Sloane here with um, her four cats. She did start with Lulu, Bagulu, and she got adopted Vern Fern so that she could have, make a friend for the cat and then they made babies which is Bandito and Fabio so got our four cats we're living in an apartment um we've got Penny our neighbor who we clearly don't have a good relationship with because she's either loud or we're loud and she doesn't appreciate it <laughs> And um, Sloane here is aspiring to be a master actress. Last stream I was trying to get this golden commercial acting gig, but didn't realize that we have to do it a certain way to get the gold. So that will be our goal today. Um, off stream I did add a couple more townies to the town just to add some more people. A um, couple places, restaurants, different places to go so that she has some stuff to do. So we'll just get started here. So our next gig is on Thursday. We'll have to get our handiness level up. Because I don't even know if we have a handy level. Somewhat. Let's see here. I don't have anything that's broken so that she could... Hmm. Let's see. Maybe we'll get her... Should we get her handiness up? Aw, cute cats. Maybe this is built by repairing Guess we could. I'm trying to see if there's something that we can upgrade without <laughs> needing that much experience. Of course not. We all need way better handy handiness to do this. I don't really know how to make things broken besides like using them a lot. I don't know. We'll figure it out. We might have to buy her one of those handiness repair tables. So that she can get better at that. Alright, well maybe we do have to buy her a handy table. That's fine. I wonder how much those cost. I can never remember where they put things. <laughs> mm. That's the flower. like the woodworking table. Oh, yeah, there it is. Do we have room to put this anywhere? Dang. Alright, 
Well, I'm gonna put this out here. some things around here to get this table back. Expensive. All right, well, we'll just move this into our inventory for now. Put our woodworking table there. We'll go with that. Guess you can craft a horse sculpture. Perfect. Get your handiness level up. I'm ready. And she did it! Yay! <laughs> That was way quicker than I thought it would be. Guess it doesn't hurt if she gets it up more. Cats are not being nice to each other when they eat. That's okay. Looks real dangerous. Oh, she pinched her finger. Ouch. Oh, we'll put that on her table. So cute. Oh, boy. Akira would like to come over and hang out. Is that okay? I suppose. Akira's kind of obsessed with us, but if he would like to come over, sure. Why not? He needs to get in good graces with our cats before we determine if we want to be with him or not. <laughs> this is our neighbor that doesn't like us. Our guard cats come into the door. So cute. <laughs> Our neighbor's singing in the hallway. We just gotta get through the day. Who said he could play with our guitar? There is too much going on right now. Too much. <laughs> Badly played music. Yeah, he's not the best musician over here. Roderick is singing pretty good out there in the hallway. I wish that he would stop. <laughs> it is way too much going on right now. My brain cannot handle it. Well... Maybe we'll send her to a restaurant. Maybe she can meet some more, meet some more people. We'll go by ourselves. We don't need to take needy Akira everywhere with us. <laughs> Alrighty. So we've got... Maybe we'll go... So Newcrest is where I added a bunch of restaurants and stuff. So we'll go here, maybe. Willow, hi. Welcome to the stream. 
You have not missed much. Shunwei, thank you for the follow. I appreciate that. I don't know if it came through on the stream, but you can see it across the stream. We're taking um, Sloan to, to a restaurant to meet some more people. Let's see. She needs more than just Akira. And clearly the person we made for her, she doesn't want and wants to start fights with, so we'll just do whatever she wants to do, I suppose. Ooh, girl. Super stylish. Let's request a table. We'll just get some food since we're hungry. Oh, she's in her nice outfit. Uh, <laughs> she looks like she does not enjoy her job. It's Sloane's world. We just exist outside it. Yeah, pretty much. Is there a kid working here, too? <laughs> okay. I feel like that goes against a little bit of child labor laws, but whatever. Brisham Wapitub. Frita? Seems weird just sending our Sloan by herself to a restaurant. Oh. Alright, we'll get her some food. Hot and smoky. A love potion. Ooh, okay. All this food looks fantastic. I want this glazed bamboo roll. That's just how the youth look nowadays. They use retinols and skincare from seeing Okay, yeah. Pretty true. I didn't... I forgot that this was a karaoke bar I made as well. <laughs> so we're gonna listen to everyone do karaoke while we eat. <laughs> That's fine. Who is this over here singing? Mortimer Goth. <laughs> if this is really loud on the stream, I apologize. <laughs> Might just be really loud in my ear, but it's pretty loud. Oh, Mortimer. Yeah. Great, great job, Mortimer. This is, um, this is Penny's husband down here. Uh -huh. <laughs> he looks angry. <laughs> So funny. We still got this kid working. <laughs> oh, Judith is here. I thought her name was Judith Ward. Did she get married? She must have. Oh, I didn't know that Sloan was up here singing. She's getting money for singing in the bathroom. <laughs> Let's sing. I feel like Mortimer needs to move out of the way. Was this our food that got dropped on the floor? It's really rude. We're having a bad experience at this restaurant.
Alright. Now we'll sing. Why is she, like, stuck in there? We're starting off great. Oh my gosh. Why is she stuck? Is there something wrong with the door? What is going on? <laughs> We're stuck in the bathroom! What is going on? Now let's go here. Something was wrong with that door. I don't know what, but... Something. No more door or wall. True. Ooh, who's this guy? Balin Croft. Well, hello! Sloan, stop. You gotta go introduce yourself. <laughs> I know. Hello. New guy, maybe. Yeah, I'm hoping so. I did add a few people, so. There's a weird glitch going on there. This is one of the girls I've added to. Logan Bates. I made her. Oh, here's another one. Oops, that's not what I meant. Ooh, can he give us our food? Hello? Hello, sir. Who's he giving that to? Just nobody over here? What in the world? Just in the kitchen making friends. AKA free food. Oh, you're right. Oh, wow. Well. Never mind. Spoke too soon. I think A. Logan and Andrew are together, I think. As far as I can tell. Maybe we'll ask him if he's single. <laughs> um, excuse me, sir, you just interrupted us. I was trying to talk to him. <laughs> oh, he is single. Why do they have the same last name? <laughs> she is starving. Someone get her some food. I tried to order food, but no one is bringing it out to me. I just want to eat. Everyone got overwhelmed that Judith was here. That they just stopped giving me my food. <laughs> I just want some food. Sure. We'll go with that. Hope they bring it to us soon. Poor girl's starving. She wants to go home and sleep, too. Bri 
bring me my food. Do you think she'll forget about us again? She might. Please don't forget about us, our food. We're starving. We'd like to go home. I like the music vibes in here, though. Maybe the cute waiter will bring us our food. Ooh, I see him coming! Oh, never mind. Not ours. Isn't that what always happens? You think it's your food? Is Judith on a war on a date? Oh, she is. Maybe she's married to Snow Davis. Whoever that is. They forgot about us. They just keep forgetting about us. I don't understand. We just want some food. What more can we ask for? Oh, he's back, but he's not back to give us our food. Just clear off plates and just ignore us that we're here. Oh, okay. Did she, did she just change colors of her dresses? She was wearing yellow and now she's wearing red. Yay, you can you can eat Sloane. Maybe the cute cute bus boy will come clean our table. Finally. Yes, oh, finally. No <laughs> oh, the cute one of the cute boys is coming on over. He's in a row. He's just coming to talk to us. Oh, Gosha. Uh -huh. Well, hello. <laughs> he just wanted to come say hi. See how we're doing still. What service? So nice of him. So nice. Wow. Someone can cook this using her, her personal chef station. Nice. Wait, why are we paying $54 for our meal when this was only $17? That is whack. Well, we'll go say hi to the bus boy before we leave. Aw, he's a dog lover. We're a cat lover. Was that it? Is that what you wanted to say? Okay, fine. We'll go home. Superb grub. I hate how slow they walk. <laughs> Stood there awkwardly. <laughs> All right, we've got a few hours till we need to go to our, our oh, is it an audition or no, it's our gig. It's our gig. Let's head to sleep since we're so tired and glitch through the door frame. Are all our counts cats accounted for? Yes. Uh, 
Sleep, sleep, sleep. Ooh, it's Harvest Fest today, and there comes all of the... Of course, this... I don't really like the <laughs> gnomes <laughs> during Harvest Fest. I don't really know what like their favorite gifts are ever, so I don't really tend to try, but... Hey, stop that. Fabio, no, no. What is... No. <laughs> Bro, why don't you just go back to sleep? You're tired. You're not even fully sli fully rested. She's just exhausted from that fun excursion. Why is her energy bar not going up? Oh. Thank you, Mia Martin, for the follow. I appreciate it. From waiting for food and seeing a cute guy. Yeah. I'm not really sure why our mail lady is glitched into our apartment. I don't know what she's doing. She needs to go. <laughs> I love how the cat... <laughs> I love how... <laughs> that is so cute. Lulu Bagula is like, this is, this is the life. So comfortable. She's just so relaxed. What do we need to send a thank you card to? I didn't know that was an option. She's just singing away in the shower. Is anybody else sing in the shower? I don't. Horrible shower. Your husband sings in the shower? Nice. Guess it would be different if I was like actually playing music and singing to it or something. Why don't we cook something to eat? Miso ramen. Cheap shower. Well, we didn't have that much money when we were building our apartment, lady, so... You're gonna have to deal with the cheap stuff till you make it as a big actress. Then we can get you a house. Then we'll do that. You wanna? You wanna boo? Yeah. Seem bozy. She's praising <laughs> Vern for being on the counter. Lulu, stop doing that. Zavarina, Frimbo. Learn not to do that. Perfect. She learned not to play in the trash. Now we've got a few other cats that need to learn that. <laughs> so a delayed reaction to the noise. Yeah. 
Oh. Thank you for suggesting I hang out with that. We had a spectacular time. Perfect. So glad you had a spectacular time, Akira. I'm so glad we suggested that for you. We're apparently still tired, though. We never fully slept. Why are all the bills so empty all the time? These cats eat so much food. <laughs> I bet that's how it feels in real life. Do cats eat a whole lot of food in real life? I've never owned a cat, so... I just pictured them as like grazing types. All right. Get some sleep. <laughs> Your cats do, but they're fat. Understandable. That would make sense. It just means they're well loved. I don't know why our sleep bar is not going up that fast. She's like exhausted. Do you want to go out on a date? No thanks, we have a gig in an hour. Less than an hour now at this point. Oh, her arm hair and her leg hair. We don't want her going to her... her acting gig with hairy arms and legs. We don't know what she's gonna turn into yet. That's okay. Oh, well, I guess she can go with leg hair. Oh, this is just her. Sure, come over. I thought this was, um, this is just her audition. Never mind. <laughs> we just let Akira come over and we're not even there. Oh, he's going to take the trash out for us. He's so nice. Woohoo, we passed. For Vladis. Vladis hardware. Is that Vlad's hardware? Maybe. Okay, we'll craft a garden pot since we gotta get our handiness skill up. He's trying so hard to show his boyfriend material. I know. He won't even come inside. He comes inside to take the trash out and then just stands there. Well, I mean, it is Harvest Fest, so maybe we should just enjoy the meal with... We'll go back to it. We'll just cook a sec. Why don't you cook with us, Akira? We're cooking... We're cooking a grand meal for you for Harvest Fest. Because we're that nice. <laughs> and clearly you're pining for Sloan, so... Maybe you should set the table. <laughs> 
don't think I can tell him what to do. Jabin? Seven A? All right, keep cooking, Sloan. Forget how long it takes to cook grand meals. It always takes so long. <laughs> She's so funny. <laughs> No! Come back! We were cooking for you! We did this for you! Can we tell him to come back? Come back! We made dinner! Don't you want some? Oh, he's sleeping now? No, get out of the food! Get out of the food! Get your butt back here and eat our food. Well, he won't because he's sleeping. Why won't it let us put the food in there? I'm gonna sell the gnomes. <laughs> Look how much money we could get from selling these things. We're broke. I really don't know why we can't put this in the fridge. Is that like a glitch or something? Or is this fridge not one that holds stuff? Well, let's put it away, see what she does with it. Okay, she puts it in the fridge. I don't know why it wouldn't give me that option. It's a little weird. Alright, when is our thing? Saturday. At 9 a.m.? Oh, well, it's only Friday, so we still have one day. We just get to develop our handiness skills and our fitness skills. It's gonna make ourselves a garden plot. I need one of those like patios so that we can put more stuff out on the patio, but we get what we can get because we're broke. You go, Sloan. What that noise? Oh, Harvest Fest was awful. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I made it such an awful holiday for you, Sloane. We tried our best, but Akira left at the last minute. He ruined it. Lifestyle gained. She's indoorsy. Guess that's fine. Oh, she hurt herself during woodworking. Where did it go that she just made? Does it go like in... Oh, it does. 
you could sell it. Give us some money! <laughs> She needs to go jogging. She's got to get her exercise up. Go for a jog. I know it's 3 a.m., but... You'll be fine. You're not even that tired. At 3 a.m. there's... <laughs> wow, it's wild around here. What's this? Look for snow globes. It's so pretty. Okay. <laughs> like this little Zen garden vibes right here. It's cute. She did it. She's glitching. <laughs> What the heck? Why is she dressed like that? I know you enjoyed that. Why don't you go upstairs? I wonder what this note says. Broderick is always leaving nice notes on here, but never nice to us. Make your night something special. I hear there is a festival where you can find your true love. Yeah, but remember, we tried to go there with you, Broderick, and you didn't want to listen. So, that's your own doing. Is there another, like, one that happens? Okay, our goal is we have to find somebody to love before love day. <laughs> We need love before love day. <laughs> All right. After her shower, she can go sleep. Please increase increase confidence. We can try. <laughs> Authentic individuals really care about you. Yay, she got a full night's sleep. Oh, you don't need to cry it out. It's just a holiday. <laughs> You'll be fine. You'll be fine. She'll live. We just filled these cat bowls and they're already almost empty or are empty. So far, this is just a chill stream, I guess. 
nothing eventful happening. Besides finding some cute staff members at a restaurant. We're doing pretty good. She's taking a really long time to eat her food. I did have, I used to have like a mod that made people eat faster. And it's been so long since I had that downloaded. There was probably like a patch update to it, so it doesn't really work anymore. No, throw your stuff away, Sloan. Silly Sloan. It's going to be our new thing that we start saying. Silly Sloan. When she does something silly. We should. Let's fill your cat bowls, empty out the litter. Guess she's just gonna feel sad and awful for days. What is it, two days? Can't we call like a sadness hotline too? All this sadness hotline. Get rid of your sadness. Oh, it's down to 24 hours. Just keep calling the sad ho sadness hotline. Let's get rid of your sadness, please. It's like therapy. <laughs> Please stop being sad. Congrats on getting that big promotion at work. You deserve it. Well, thank you, Akira. That is the nicest thing that you've said to us. Maybe. I really don't know how to get people's sadness down unless we just do all of the... Give yourself a pep talk, cry it out. Want her to not be sad. Zer, a friend of war. Reba, move. Foley, Gabonis, Giuseppe, Rabla, Clarsham, Lamina. <sighs> 19 hours instead now? You're going to need to stop. <laughs> Gonna need to get happy somehow. Why is he always coming over? Sure. You can come over. Maybe you can make us happier. Kira's like obsessed with us. <laughs> he asked to come over and then he's like... Oh, there he is. Therapeutic chat. Aww. Now only four hours? We need to get rid of it. Get rid of your sadness. Ooh, did you see that we're good compatibility with Braylon? Cute. I feel like if we were trying to, heck yeah, four hours left, three hours now, we're going to get her sadness away. She's so neat freak that she keeps trying to clean everything in the apartment. We don't need it cleaned. Just stop. <laughs> okay. Anyways, I was saying if we travel with Akira, is he going to get jealous? 
if we start thinking that some boys are cute and start flirting with boys? I think so. We're going to have to travel alone. Can't bring him with us. If he shows up, I guess, whatever. That's his own doing, but. She was about to do something romantic with him and we stopped her. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Let's see what I've got here. I've got a library, a nightclub, shopping center, a gym. Do you think she wants to go to the gym? Park. Hmm. Maybe we'll go to the bowling alley. It says romantic auras there, so maybe. Thanks for giving me that achievement all the time. What do we got here? We've got <laughs> the oldies crowd. Probably because we're going at 3 p.m. <laughs> well, hello there. Stop bowling, Sloan. <laughs> Adrian Hobbs. Well, hello there. Is it weird if we just start straight up asking everyone if they're single? Oh, mm -hmm. uh, he's married. Well, at least we got that out of the way. It sure is the oldies crowd. <laughs> Guess that prohibits us from trying to see, trying to flirt. Just straight up off the bat. Oh, whoa. <laughs> just off the bat, just ask people if they're single so that we don't have to embarrass ourselves and start falling for someone who's married or taken. Poor Sloane. She doesn't know how to bowl. Whoa. Nice. She got a strike. It really is the oldies crowd around here. Where's the young people at? Thank you, Riggs, for the follow. Eleanor Sullivan has asked me out on a date. Should I say yes? I don't really want to tell him what to do. So we'll let him decide. He's like, we, we must be his like one and only friend because he clearly needs our opinion on everything. Whoa. It's like a fireball. Not to be confused with the alcoholic beverage. <laughs> this creepy old lady. I might need to change venues because this is not hopping. With it's just hopping with old people. All right, we'll travel again. We'll figure out. 
where else to go that has... I mean, is it bad to go to a nightclub right now? Probably not. We'll go there anyways. It's a long loading screen. Anyone here? Uh, Kyle Carlson. I think I'm getting a cold. I'm going to grab something at the Spice Festival to see if we can melt the germs out of me. Want to tag along? I mean, we always go everywhere Kira lets us go with him, or we always let him come over. Why not? Maybe we can find somebody at the Spice Festival. <laughs> Why not? I forgot it always loads you into... What do we got over here? We've got Thorn Bailey. Attempt the curry challenge. I don't think I've ever been to the Spice Festival. <laughs> Son's over here just performing to nobody. Should we attempt the... Spicy curry, curry challenge together. I want to see how this goes. See if Sloan can handle a little bit of heat. I mean, that is our one goal of coming to the Spice Festival, is to eat spicy food. <laughs> Are we going to burn our tongues off? She failed at it. Burnt tongue. I thought we were going to do this spicy challenge together. Where is he going? He's just disappearing. You can see into this apartment. <laughs> Hello, anybody in there? It's creepy. We're gonna be a Peeking Tom. So don't give away our money. We're broke. There's so many foods. Home now, 
When does the spice festival end? Three hours? No, we're ending it early. We don't need to be here for three hours. You don't need a drink, Sloan, either. Go home. <laughs> Go home. We have stuff we need to do. Like sleep. We need to sleep. When is our gig? Our gig is at 9 a.m. on Saturday. So I'm roughly 13 hours. Yes. <laughs> Is she knowing? Why does she always glitch out? <laughs> Anyone think that Penny or Broderick is going to come up and knock on our door saying we're too loud? <laughs> it honestly wouldn't surprise me if they did. We need a little bit of drama. Does she like guitar? Yes, yeah, she does. I mean, Penny's right here. We'll see if she comes knocks on the door for being too loud. <laughs> I mean, she looks sad. Do you think her and her husband are having marital issues? They look sad. Ooh, and Broderick's in the hallway. I'm waiting for someone to knock. What if this is like... What if like Penny just leaves her husband and then gets with Broderick because they're both mean? Our cats have the zoomies. I think you should go to sleep, Sloan. <laughs> All right, we've got few hours till our gig woohoo feels like it takes forever though like from one gig to another you gotta audition and that takes a day to get to the audition and then it takes another day to get to the actual gig and it just takes a while <laughs> Well, go pee, silly goose. Where's all of our cats? Oh, there's the other one. Where are our cats?
How's your weekend been? It's been good. How was yours? My weekends are pretty chill. I just... Relax, enjoy the time off. Hung out with a buddy and played some games. Good. It's always a good thing. Can't complain about that. Always a good time. Good. It's good to hang out with friends every once in a while. Catch up with them. For sure. All right, we've got two hours. Ideal mood is to be confident. Do you think? I don't even know how to make her confident. <laughs> you used to live together at one point and you weren't super into that. Yeah, I mean, I hear that. If you want to stay friends, good friends with someone, you probably shouldn't live with them. For... Gotta keep your friendship the way that it is, and a lot of people do things weird. <laughs> Might get annoyed with how they brush their teeth or something. <laughs> how oh, they never do dishes. Yeah, or that. That would be a... That'd be a no-go. <laughs> huh. oh. You gotta do your fair share if you're dirtying, dish dirtying dishes. Gotta clean up after yourselves. Huh. <laughs> Why don't you take a shower? He was good about paying his part of the rent, at least. I mean, that you can't complain there. I mean, as long as people are contributing to the cost of things, it's great. But they've got to contribute in other ways as well. <laughs> the, up, the upkeep of the apartment. Or, this, or the house. Whatever one you live in. Sloan is always singing. He would be into Call of Duty at the time and forget that anything else existed. I mean, I feel that way sometimes when you game. You kind of get absorbed into it. and But there is life outside of games. <laughs> When are we? Okay, there it is. <laughs> I was like, this is the longest hour. All right, let's make us some money. Now, to get a gold status, I think we have to risky, do like a risky, can't remember exact words. <laughs> like a risky audition <laughs> or a risky scene. Oh, cute. Different set this time. All right. Let's go get into a hair and makeup. I always think about sprucing up like the the sets and stuff, but Just 
Just to make it so that everything's like not so far to walk to things like all in one area right next to the stage so you could just go from one point to the other. Have I done where my sim can own a restaurant? No, I have not. <laughs> I've always done where they own like a vet clinic, but I forget that you can own more than just a vet clinic. Wingsa. I have not done that. I'm just really into like building and making sims that like sims play. There is things that I probably do not know. Things you learn over time. All right, she's got to gossip about something. Your current playthrough, you want to own a pizzeria if they let you. That'd be pretty cool. I really should think about doing that. Building a restaurant, owning it. I don't know why my brain just automatically goes to... You can only own a vet clinic. But I guess obviously there's way more than that. Poshima? In a prim. I always snoop. She's having a baby. <laughs> oh, think well. There's also retail stores. Yeah. Shuna. There is. <laughs> uh -huh. Have I even visited a retail store in The Sims? Never. <laughs> I forget that those exist. I wouldn't even know what kind of stores, like clothing, electronics. Do you have to like buy all the electronics to sell them? I don't know. Really don't know. <laughs> You just end up working on stat skills. Yeah. I'm definitely a make a fit, make a sim, fall in love, have kids, raise the kids. Send the kids to school type of simmer. <laughs> That's how I do things. Why are you running back over here? Do you not want to make friends with people? Prompampe. <laughs> Who's like Jeff now? <laughs> oh, Lempima. Bobanet? Hmm. Ooh, Kidepta. Yano Borp. Free nip. Gung day. All right, we gotta tell the director we're ready. Moochie Peachy. Kribixta. This is Eric. Bibose. Jewel. Uh huh. Aren't you the director? You had a Ma'am. <laughs> Sir. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate that. You play like a hermit, just busy getting all your skills to max. Yep. I like that too. But like, once you throw in a bunch of other sims, I usually just focus on like one sim at a time it's so hard like when they start having kids and like i know a lot of people they play the sims and they do like the generations thing and then they move on to the next generation and i'm like i could never give up the first one <laughs> it's too good put the food down <laughs> You haven't even messed with all that, yeah. 
I eventually, maybe, actually, we'll do whiskey repair fridge first. Yeah, I have not messed with that. I will, maybe. I thought about doing that. Like a legacy challenge kind of thing. That would be... That would be cool to do. Uh, is she like a vampire repairman? <laughs> I feel like the Sims age too quickly to where all I have time for is dying is getting my final promotion at work so that I don't get fed up and turn off auto-aging. Yeah, have you ever turned it like up a little higher than like just the week? Like I think there's like the 14 days or the 28 days of like a week. Or like in a season, I guess I should say. I don't really know, remember what it is. I think it's like, is there only like two options maybe where it's, I'll have to check. I can't remember where it is. The season length, like seven days, 14 or 28 days. Yeah. So like doing that instead. You're not sure, but I see is an option to turn off completely. And I was like, yes, please. Yeah. I mean, it has its benefits to... Like, I don't like when people die, but I mean, I've also played with like grandparents raising like a teenager and then the grandparents dying and then playing as like the teenager kind of thing. Sloan got gold. Woohoo. Fame earned. The crew is shutting down. The footage is being sent to editing. Way to go, Sloan. Way to go. We have successfully completed that milestone of the master actress portion. She's a notable newcomer now. Palimba Bay. Uh -huh. What? We are gonna make her famous. But her reputation sucks for some reason. Should we give her a fame point yet or wait till she gets to the next star? Mm. I don't know. I think we need to celebrate by, for one, getting another audition. And then for two, we need to ce celebrate by going out on the town. What do joining crews do when you get the text? So it's like social groups. So you can like join a club. You can make your own club and get like invite certain people to your club. And then you can start like club hangouts anywhere. You can make like your club hangout like a certain spot or you can go anywhere and then you would just click on this tab and it would show up here and you would just hit start um hang out and then all the people in your club just show up to wherever you are at that time that's pretty neat yeah i've used it a lot um a lot of times i do that with like the kids can join clubs 
So, like, I'll make the kids have a club of, like, all their friends so their friends can start, like, hangouts and they can hang out with the other friends and hang out like that. That's fun. I do it that way or, like, I know, like, I played one of my playthroughs. I had a girl that um, went off to college and met some girls at college and she went home and started a life and would invite her girlfriends to come over every now and then and I would just start a hangout at whatever house we were at and just invite her college friends over so that was fun I like that aspect of it I don't use it a lot because I forget about it but it is very fun to do all right she has an audition tomorrow Let's just stress the emotion of excitement over your performance in the commercial. We will update the prediction models reflect on the surprising outcome. You wish you never bought the vampire DLC. It's so annoying. I have never actually played with... I talked about that last in my last stream that I've like dated vampires, but I've never played a sim as an actual vampire and... I always disallow vampires like every time I start playing because I just don't really want them. <laughs> just don't want them to be in my business. But go into your house and mess your sim up. Yeah, that's why I just hit locked door for. Well. No trespassing, va disallow vampires. So that's what I always do so that they stay out of my business. <laughs> Last stream, um, we had Vlad that kept walking to our door and then he would just disappear. So I think he was like ready to come in and then he realized he couldn't. So he left right away. He did that a couple of times. It was, cool. it was funny. You didn't know you could lock it for only the vampires? Yeah. Absolutely. You can disallow your neighbors to show up. Solicitors. You can lock it for like certain people. Like I could lock it for all my cats so they don't leave. Or like if you have a baby, like you can apply baby proofing to the door. Yeah. Add it to your next gameplay. It's, I definitely enjoy disallowing vampires. <laughs> So I don't have to deal with them. Oh no. She just starts mopping it. You have to fix it first before you just mop a continuous stream of water. <laughs> Silly Sloan. Our cat's just licking them. <laughs> And then we got Vern over here who's got the zoomies. Okay, now you can mop Sloan. Vern is still just... <laughs> zoom, zoom, zoom in! Okay, last time I played, there was an option to fill all the bowls. And now I have to fill them all individually and I don't understand. That's fine. Oh, Akira ended up not going on a date with Eleanor. I'm not surprised because he's in love with us. Who are we kidding? Ah, Shippy, Eleanor. No, don't. Well, I guess you could do that, but That wasn't my plan to tell him not to get on the counters. Um, maybe we'll nap. I know I said we're going to go celebrate her being a notable newcomer.
Akira, I swear. He is just obsessed. Alright. Let's go. Do we want to invite anyone? Let's invite Braylon. We liked talking to him last time. We have a good compatibility with him as well. Maybe we'll go to this party place. Yeah. We'll go party it up at the lounge. We'll have fun with Braylon and whoever else comes our way. Because we don't settle for just the first man that starts talking to us. <coughs> Akira. <laughs> Well, hello. Haka, Rix. Oh, <laughs> no. Oh, I do. <laughs> Even this guy's cute. Who is this? Oh, we already talked to him. That's why. <laughs> I forgot about him. <laughs> oh. Oh. He's <laughs> He just died. <laughs> oh my goodness. We don't even know him. Why are we sad about it? Oh my god. <laughs> okay, I don't play The Sims enough to <laughs> <laughs> to witness random deaths of random people. So this is this is kind of comical to me. I should laugh. Right, it's a really sad time. But also Wait, what? <laughs> Did you see how cute this guy is over here though? All right, now that that happened, <laughs> everyone's sad. Everyone's just staring at his urn. He's an entertainer. Aww. This guy's just getting in a speedo. Oh, it's okay, buddy. Wow, they're hitting it off over here. Kind of. Not really. Oh, probably because they have bad compatibility. <laughs> it's okay, buddy. You didn't even know him. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that was fun. <laughs> Such a random, a random thing to happen. Well, why are you wearing? 
If it's cold outside, why don't you change? sentiment well they're hitting it off nice I thought we already talked to Andrew Bates is this a different Bates There is two Andrew Bates in this. <laughs> I have two of the same people in the <laughs> What? All right. I mean, one is single, but not this one that we're talking to. This Andrew is, because we already asked him if he was. <laughs> it's so sad well there's always that at least yeah well at least one of them's single and one of them's taken it's just funny well, maybe we should leave because our date left. And now we're just sad because a random person died. It's okay. We'll get over it. We just got rid of our sadness from, like, I don't know, what, a day ago? And now we got it back. From a stranger. Oh, man. Quit glitching. It's too funny. Sleep, 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 sleep. Sleep. It's the start of winter. Woohoo! Yay, the start of winter. Does anyone else like playing in winter? I like all the snow and making snowmen. I do that a lot if I play with kids. I make them make, like the siblings make snowmen together. I think that's fun. It's cute. Super cute. Yeah. And then the kids get like a cute like sentiment um, with each other about like playing in the snow, doing snow activities together. It's so cute when they do that. Make a wedding cake. No, we don't need to make a wedding cake. We're not getting married yet. Oh, Lulu Bagulu is going in heat. So cute. Lulu 
you do? It's okay. It's okay, Lulu. I got rid of it, don't worry. <laughs> I saw that. Got rid of it. <laughs> I'm a new streamer. I don't need help with anything yet. And if I need help, I'll just ask somebody who else who I know that streams. <laughs> She's just so sad from seeing someone die. She just cannot contain herself. You talked to one once because it was late and you were bored. Yeah. They just want to sell over it. Yeah. I got a brief overview about it. About like people that just jump into your streams and things. And I've heard a lot of those, like, from watching other streamers, they get a lot of those, obviously, as well. But I'm not, like, a big streamer that has somebody to take a look at the chat and start banning things like that. So I kind of have to pay attention. Oh, no! Oh no! <laughs> Lulu, don't have more kittens! You already had two! It's been happening a lot. They target new guys. Yeah, they do. I did hear that. That's their goal. But, I mean, we are the streamers. We can decide what, what we want to respond to. Where are you going? Where's she going? <laughs> Girl. It's fun it's funny to mess with one of these people. Yeah, sometimes. Who's this? You like messing with telemarketers? Do you answer a lot of telemarketing calls? Did we go to, like, tell our cat that he needed to come home? <laughs> Is that what we just did? Well, we need to get- we already have a fitness level 2 anyways. Fitness level is 3, actually. Well, we could go out again. Oh, sorrowful. I love how they get like glitched <laughs> in their um homes like this. It makes me laugh. I think it's funny. She's just he's just like stuck in the wall. Stop crying, Sloane. Should we just go on a date with Akira because he just... Why do we want to go to a Paddy Wax Emporium? I don't really want to go on a date, Akira. We have other options. Like Braylon over here who we have good compatibility with. Friendly advice. 
We know he's a high school graduate with average <laughs> class ranks. Ah, Penny, stop touching our cat. We don't even like you. She needs to get this sadness gone. I'm so tired of her crying. You didn't even know them. <laughs> It doesn't even go here. <laughs> That's what I thought of when I said that. <laughs> Just be happy, Sloan. Penny likes to either visit her mailbox a lot or visit her trash can a lot. It's one or the other. <sighs> she has that neat trait and it drives me nuts because she's always trying to do things. So I know we're famous now. <laughs> We want networking, noticeable, or corporate partnership. Let's make Sloan noticeable. I think that's a good trait to have. It's a good trait to have. Do you think Braylon's still sad from the death or do you think he's okay? I'm not sure. Maybe we'll chat. I did say that we need to find her someone to love before love date, so... Braylon's a good one! Why am I only allowed to ask Don Lothario and Akira on a date? What the heck? Okay, well we'll just invite him to come over. So he can come meet our cats and see what what he thinks of cats. I know he's a dog lover, but... Maybe he'll like cats, too. We will see. Come on in. Come into my apartment. Let's have a deep conversation. <laughs> oh yeah, he's still sad. I can fix that. All right, he's just fine now. But now she's sad. She doesn't need to talk about death. Yeah. 
She's like spirited sims. Sure. So cute. Look at how cute they are together. I love it. This is my favorite part of The Sims. <laughs> I like when they go for cute people. They're getting along so well. I don't know why she's like looking off in the opposite way of what he's talking to her. He's a genius. He's a genius, materialistic, and a dog lover. Well, I mean, that's not bad qualities. You're just thinking that? Yeah, I don't know why she does that. <laughs> she just randomly starts stretching. <laughs> Why not? Why not? Well, now she's facing the right way, so. Let's see if he takes jokes well. Oh. I'm asked to be woohoo mar partners right off the bat. <laughs> Adoring sentiments. <laughs> they like each other. <laughs> He's a waiter level one at the sushi karaoke bar. Yeah, we know. <laughs> we know he is. <laughs> Let's watch. You should join us and watch this movie. We can nap together? What? How do you do that? How do you nap together? Do you need like a bigger couch to do that? Why is it giving me the option? But won't let me do it. I just want to nap to you. Where are we going? Where are we going? Why are we in the room? Oh, this is the cutest thing ever. What? I did not know this was an option. I don't know if this is a mod that I have or what. But this is actually cute. Super adorable. I love this. 
<laughs> oh man, sucker for romance. <laughs> and our cats over here just like chilling. <sighs> this is so cute. I can't. <laughs> Oh, they're gonna go back to cuddling. Akira's jealous. Oh, they're so cute. What a cute couple, my goodness. It's settled, we're going for Braylon. Look at how freaking cute they are. <laughs> They need to go on a date. But it's 5 p.m. and our audition is at 7 p.m. tonight. So, guess it has to be tomorrow. So cute. I love it. Adorbs. Hi, welcome in. She's doing push-ups in the hallway. She's got to get ready for that audition. Oh. So cute. Let's see, we'll have her use the potty. I honestly am so curious as to if that was a mod that makes them cuddle, nap together and cuddle together. I really don't know. I will have to look that up. I don't know where... You made your guy an athlete and think it would be a famous NBA player or something. They might... They have me working as a team mascot. It's funny to see my dude in his costume. Yeah, well, they start you off as like a mascot for the team, and then and then you then you can get up higher as soon as you play more. Um, to be honest, I'm not sure because we don't want you to spend any time with anyone other than us, Braylon. singing is fantastic. We love it. <laughs> okay, go to your audition, girlfriend. No. Carrie, you could not come over. We found ourselves an old, our own man, Akira, that pays attention to us and cuddles and naps with us. They determined our vocal source tones to be satisfactory. All right. Gotta love the Sims. Yep. Never fails to entertain you, no matter what. Never fails. Well, now that we got that. It's on Tuesday, so we got two days. 
we're doing so good. We're probably going to get promoted our next time that we go to our gig. Okay. Now that we're feeling better, or now that we're... Why is it still only giving us the option to do that? I do have the Simda dating app and I can actually pick someone to go on a date with. Thank you. People that we talk to. Yes, Braylon. We want to go on a date with Braylon. <laughs> Laughlin and friends. <laughs> We're just friends. <laughs> Where should we go? We need to go somewhere like... Should we go to a restaurant? Ooh, an Italian restaurant. Yeah. <laughs> this lot has an on key. On. <laughs> wow. Can't speak. You know what I meant. Your only friend on your. My only friend on my new guy is a puppy doggo. Nice. That's funny. <laughs> That's the only friend is a dog. <laughs> I love dogs. <sighs> Usually when I play The Sims, I play with dogs because I just think they're so cute and fun. Oh, I forgot that it was snowing. You better run inside, girl. I don't want neither of you to die. What is wrong with the restaurant? Why can't you go in? It's going to freeze out here. Please don't die. Okay. Something is blocking their way of getting up the stairs. And I think it's like these bushes or something. Not entirely sure what is stopping them from getting in. Just let me in. We'll just sell all this stuff. Okay, try that. Can you go here now? Ma'am. Uh -huh. We haven't gone anywhere yet, but when I go anywhere, it gives me the option to invite the dogs to come with me to the club or the gym. That's funny. I like that. Is it like... Do we need to like drop the building down itself? Not sure what the issue is here. Well, I guess we could do that. This needs to go down one more then. I don't know what's going on. I'm just trying to go to a romantic dinner. Okay. <laughs> oh, now it's the light that's in the way. Do you, think, do you think we'll ever be able to get inside this place? 
Is everything out of the way? <laughs> I didn't like test these out before I I should have guessed. I don't understand. You haven't had that issue where it won't let you get inside? I don't... <laughs> yeah, I mean, I have mods. Oh my gosh, he's freezing! Let's not die, please. Let's do this again, but obviously not at this venue, because clearly we're having a problem with this, with this venue. We'll go to a different one. It's fine. He keeps trying to shovel snow. I did not play test like all of these though, so it might be my own fault on that. It's okay. We'll be fine. It's all right. <laughs> it's like my go-to. It's okay. It's fine. I just didn't want Braylon to up and die on us. Seeing as our luck is going, every time we create a guy or f like a guy, something always goes wrong. We always go back to Akira, but who knows? This is a long load in. It'll buff out every time you crash your truck in American Truck Simulator. <laughs> That's a good one. It's fine. We could fix that. <laughs> it's funny. Well, this is fantastic. My Sims is not doing too hot right now.
I know I've been having some like internet problems lately. I don't think that's the issue here. You're always worried about playing with mods because stuff like that. Yeah, I... I love the mods. I can't... <laughs> I don't know what I would do without the, some of them. Like, the MC Command Center is probably one of my favorite things. Because you can fix a lot of those, like, mod errors with that. Like, if... I don't know. Like, you can fix a lot of things in the game. Like someone dying. You can kill someone off on there. Make them happy if they're, like, about to die or something. We can fix it. I mean, there's a lot of th good things that come with that MC Command Center, but... Like, clothing options and hair and accessories and stuff. I just love the way that it looks. Like, I just really enjoy building sims, using using like build mode items like I have a lot of build mode um cc too because it's it's just fun to add that to the game I like realistic looking things and I know like a lot of the hairstyles aren't like super realistic looking in the sims but I just like when you use like actual like hair looking items You have mods in City Skyline, building roads in that game, and traffic mods are super needed. Yeah. Some mods are needed. I would say for The Sims, at least, like, MC Command Center is, like, super needed. Alright. I am going to try to fix this a second. But I have to do it a certain way to try to fix it. Let's see here. Otherwise, it's just gonna sit here and keep spinning the whole time and nothing like. Ooh. I'm not sure if I can fix this. It's like completely frozen on The Sims. This is a terrible, <laughs> terrible time. If I can't fix this, I might have to, end the stream here. Cause I'm not getting anywhere. It won't let me do anything. Hate when that happens, yeah. Same. <laughs> okay, let's see here. I might have fixed it, so bear with me.
Okay. <laughs> we're back into The Sims, but the last time we saved is when they were um, in front of the restaurant. So that's actually not that bad. Sorry for the technical glitches that lasted way longer than I wanted it to. So good thing I saved my game. I'm really bad at that. So <laughs> I'm 100% always forgetting to save my save my games. I have lost three hours worth of Sims gaming before. Like, just the whole three hours. Just didn't save it. I don't know what I was thinking, what was going through my mind. I was building a lot of stuff. I was making a lot of families and then it just completely went out on me and I was like, oh my gosh. If this doesn't load, like I want it to, I might end the stream. I do have some things going on today I gotta do, but depending on if this loads or not. That'd be a nightmare to forget to save after all that work. Yeah. 100%. It was absolutely terrible. I was very upset about it. If I would have cried, I would have cried about it. If <laughs> it honestly, it wasn't that bad. I I knew a lot of the stuff that I did, anyways, but a lot of it was like I don't know. I just remade everything eventually. I wasn't like into gameplay where I was like actually like losing a bunch of the gameplay and having to do it again. At least it was just like building and creating Sims. Cause I always enjoy doing that anyways. So just doing that in general was fun to me to do it again. I mean, <laughs> that was okay. I didn't mind it. But like I said, like if I was to lose like this, like especially this stream, like I saved maybe a handful of times this stream, which shame on me. I mean, I really need to learn. <laughs> One of these days it's going to bite me in the butt and it's going <laughs> to it's going to end poorly. So I'm going to go to like Somewhere where no one can die, <laughs> preferably. I mean, they could die anywhere, I guess, but. Yeah. I have a feeling that most of this like long loading thing has to do with like our internet has been like super spotty here. It's guys night, gentlemen Sims can sign up to the bar for discounted drinks. Wow. That sucks. <laughs> Why can't I get discounted drinks? Somewhere where no one can die. Yeah, really. Your sim just got over that last death of a stranger. <laughs> I know. That's that's the worst thing ever. Let's make a joke. We really have to ask him if he's single? I thought we already did that. What if all this time he's not single? <laughs> that would suck. <laughs> I'm learning from my mistakes to keep saving. <laughs> oh, good. He is single. Thank goodness. I held my breath there for a second. That would really suck. <laughs> 
She wants to give a massage to him already. I always try to wait till like the end to like kiss your date. I just don't want to like. Kiss him right away. You were cuddling in your bed, it turns out he was married. <laughs> that would have been funny. I probably wouldn't get over that. I'd be really sad to learn that he's not single. Look at how well they're going. They're already getting like romance bar up. Oh, let's hold hands. Have deep conversation with your date. Do you ever use the first camera mode? No! What mode is that? How do you do that? I've never heard of that. It's a trip to see the sim from their perspective. Shift tab. <gasps> no way! Whoa, I didn't know that actually. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. <laughs> Let's have their first kid kiss and watch it. It's so neat. Oh, that's so cute. How do you get out of it now? Oh, like that. That is so cool. Thank you for telling me that. I didn't even know that was an option. Shift tab again. Yeah. I kind of figured it was that. I kind of hit the wrong button at first there. <laughs> Just tab. <laughs> that is so funny. It's so cool to see your house from their actual perspective. Yeah, I'm gonna have to do that when I get back to the um the apartment just to see what it looks like. I didn't even know that was a thing. I know like this thing is a thing, like zooming in. But like I had no idea. You just be eating TV or watching TV and eating food in the first person mode. That's sweet. Like you're actually there. That's awesome. I am definitely going to have to use that more often. I kind of want to like... Oh, that's so cute. I mean, it's a really touchy mouse, though, too. Like, that is so cool. I love that. <laughs> I mean, it'd be kind of hard to like walk around and do first person mode, mode because I don't really do that like in gaming. I'm not really like a, I've never really done like big games like that. I usually do like games like this. Moving the mouse will like break it. Oh, are you like you moving it with like the key, the keys then? No. Yeah, like, this seems, like, wild. Yeah. 
I like how she's just like joining in on this like flirtatious conversation. You don't move it, you just let them do their own thing and it follows what they're looking at. Oh, okay. That makes sense. Wixana Zarspa. Usanet Pandole. Alibar. Totally digging me. This could be the start of a beautiful relationship. It seems to be. Why won't it let me, like. I guess, buddy. <laughs> Chinosa. Lance of Zarde. Spabim of Alo? Ah, Banarla. Swag. I'm confused why, like, there's no option to, like, be, like, physically affec affectionate right now. I need to get my sim a date. LOL. Yeah. <laughs> You're too much of a workaholic. I understand it. I can get it. I mean, you're making money, so. I wonder how, like, what does that. Oh, whoa. <laughs> This is so cute. Let's ask him to be our boyfriend. Yay! Your sim is super broke. Yeah, I'm not that rich either. Oh, she's romantic. She's discovered. So cute. Aw, what a cute day. Who said he was done? Was he leaving? Mochi Pichi, yeah. That's a, that's a pretty common one. I love the Simmons. Yeah, I mean, I'm not really good at like say, knowing what they're saying exactly, but I could piece it together for the most part. little bit more time I can play The Sims for before I gotta get off, but it's a random kid here. Child. Susu is high? Yeah. I, th I think you're right. I love the glitch. I'm 100% certain that that glitch that they do when they bend over to pet the cats or something is my mod. <laughs> I think it is. But sometimes it's really, really funny when they do like weird things. Like I have one like item of clothing that like if my Sim is wearing it and they're holding a kid, the kid's like at their ankles, like attached to their ankles and their arms are like really elongated. And it makes me laugh <laughs> every time I see it. And sometimes I forget when I put it on like the sim that they're doing that. But <laughs> other times I do it on purpose because I want to see it. I think it's like a pajama short I have. I think it's actually the PJ pants that um, Sloan is wearing when she goes to bed. That does it. But I'm not entirely sure.
Yeah, I think it's those shorts that do it, but there's like a couple. I know it's shorts. I just can't remember which ones that do it. I do. I think my favorite Sims pack that I've recently bought is the. Um... Oh, Father Winter adopted this child. How cute. Um, The growing together pack. I had to buy that the second it came out. I didn't even wait for it to like. be fixed like if there was any like weird things going on with it i had to buy it immediately i know they like updated the fact that like you can get in infants in like base game and stuff but like getting the growing together pack just makes it so much easier when you have the kids oh no oh no cat fight Oh boy, who is it? That's your son! Why are you getting in a fight with your son, Vern? You good there? Lecture about attacking. Yeah, I guess we could lecture him about attacking. Oh! Well, I heard you and Braylon started dating. Congrats on landing a new boyfriend. Why does this seem like passive aggressive from Akira? <laughs> but also, the guy that we made for Sloan is like living it up in this apartment, being all lovey dovey with someone. Last time he was doing this and the hearts were coming out, he came out in a towel. He did it again! <laughs> he came out in a towel again. We always yell at our neighbors because they yell at me. That was a bit inconsiderable. We'll try to keep the noise down. Thanks for letting us know, good neighbor. I didn't expect him to act like that. Let's go over to Braylon's house since he's inviting us over. We just had a date with him and he wants to hang out with us again. So cute. So cute. I love a good guy who can't stand the thought of being away. Who's he got? Clay? Just Clay is in here. Are we gonna relax together? Awesome username, by the way, KK Slider. It's like the coolest dude out of Animal Crossing. Thank you! I actually go by KK, so. Mm -hmm. It's a must. It's the first game I ever got into as well is Animal Crossing. First game I ever bought for the Switch. First game I ever started playing. Actually before The Sims, surprisingly. Because I don't... I didn't know about The Sims for a while. I didn't know that it existed. You're obsessed with it on Nintendo DS. Yeah, I played it a bit on, like, a DS. Um, I borrowed someone's and I was playing it for a bit on there. And then I ended up buying a Switch and getting, like, the, the Switch version of that one. The New Leaf. I thought we were relaxing together on the bed over here. Maybe we'll nap together again. That was cute. But yes, when I told when I told my fiance what my nickname was, um, 
was KK. He immediately was like, like KK Slider? And I was like, yes. <laughs> exactly like that. So I just kind of stuck from now on. Look at how cute they are. Whoa. This is adorable. It would have been the same way, like, dude, KK Slider is the coolest. Yeah. He's a... A rogaba, Hanabor, He's a cool... A cool guy. Such a good... Singer. Best singer out there. <laughs> Do you have, like, a favorite KK Slider song? Falabalom. <laughs> Who Harpin? Nar Vadish. Ah, Flarzen. Mwah. Ha ha. Shish, you be. What a shivu. Oh. Hmm. Not that you can think of on the top of your head. I'd say my favorite is probably the bubble gum. KK. They're like totally in love with each other. So Shina Zeke. You dupes up. It's the cutest thing in the world. Oh. Rebna? Kalibna Brack. Aw, Sloan felt Still completely like safe in her partner's arm and she can't help but smile. She looks up at her partner feeling grateful to have them in her life. That's so cute. Aww. The cutest thing ever. Where is she going? <laughs> We're just chilling here while our boyfriend is doing whatever he's doing. <laughs> Should we serenade our boyfriend? I think we should. I think we should. You're right, this is cool. Whoa. <laughs> so. Ooh. <laughs> Now that I know this thing exists, I feel like I'm just going to be using it so much. Why is she looking all over the place? I swear, my hands are up. I'm not doing it. Oh, you love doing it so much on The Sims. Yeah. I think that might be my new favorite. Let's passionate kiss and see what this looks like when we passionately kiss him. <laughs> A little messy. <laughs> Got Jamie Croft, Quinn Croft, ah, so so, and Clay Russ. What's our guy's last name? Braylon Cobb. That must be like his brothers then. 
Cute. First person mode isn't perfect, but it'll do. I can see that. I can see it being like that. Music is the best way to say I love you. Aw, how cute. All right, we gotta go back home to our cats. I wanna see her leave. <laughs> this is so cool. Bye, boyfriend. Bye, boyfriend's brothers. Oh, I guess it won't let me do first person in this. This spot, obviously. <laughs> We don't want to go anywhere with you, Akira. Google Newsfeed a couple years ago was talking about how The Sims added first person mode, and you're like, oh my gosh, I need it. Yeah. I mean, 100%, I had no idea. First person mode is wild. Develop your fitness skill. Cry on I forgot that you could cry on demand. Pretty sure this might be a mod, but I'm actually not entirely sure. I was thinking about checking the city today. Can I use your place to get ready? I mean, did he really ask or did he just tell us that he was using our place to get ready? <laughs> I don't really think he asked. But sure. If you would like. We did give him our... Aww. Our cats like him. So cute. Why are you so grungy? Girl, you need a shower. Oh, not clean. <laughs> Have you done a playthrough doing the YouTube streaming path? No. I don't think. Is it- is there like something specifically that you do or? 
Or are you saying it's super legit? Yeah, no, I didn't do that. Um, I do upload like these streams to YouTube. That's the only thing I've actually ever done with YouTube. <laughs> I haven't been on YouTube in a while, so I didn't know that was a thing. Oh wait, you can have your sim be a YouTuber in the game? Yes, I have gone that route. I have actually, yeah. With like the recording studio and I had like a drone that like follows you around too. But you have that like set up where it has like the streaming stuff in front of it as well. Yes, then yes, I know what you're talking about. I thought you were talking about like legitimately you two. <laughs> Why does he keep getting all these drinks out? Why does he keep doing this? This is like his third glass of milk that he's had. You like doing that in first person mode and seeing him work on editing and recording software? Yeah, that's cool, actually. Well, now that I know it exists, I might use it a lot. Huh. See her wash dishes? Wow, it's Penny's getting loud in there. Nice music choice, Penny. my dreams the music you like the music she's listening to she's still being really loud <laughs> you're a fan of metal and punk Nice. As is my fiance, he's, he's a big fan of big fan of metal, so it's not the first time I've heard music like that. <laughs> You'd be down to party with Penny. Yeah, if Penny didn't hate us, maybe we could be friends with her, but she yells at me, I yell at her, so I love how she said she'll try to keep it down, but then she's like <laughs> still in there being loud. It's fine. It's fine. Anobi! Sims living in an apartment. I don't think I ever got along with the neighbors. Yeah. I don't think 
you're meant to get along with your neighbors in your apartment. As far as I know. Maybe we'll just like be as equally as loud. And I'm pretty sure that like they're just annoying. I'm pretty sure that this like apartment complex too is got like lively neighbors and I can't like remove it. So this apartment complex in itself is known for this. And I know other apartment living ones are like that. They're just being annoying and loud. Yeah, I think it's meant to be like that on purpose. But hey, it's fine. Look, she's knocking on our door for being loud. Can you kindly keep the noise down? Are you joking? <laughs> are you joking? Why are you yelling that I'm loud? Have you heard yourself? So. The You're the loud one. <laughs> Have you heard yourself though? You were not even audible compared to that rock music. I know. I can't even like go to sleep because it's too noisy over there. Did she just move out? Well, I don't think we're going to sleep anytime soon, so... <sighs> Clean up what? What are you cleaning up? Oh, the one in the hallway. Yeah. Well, I don't really know. Giving you flashbacks of when you lived in a ghetto apartment after you graduated high school. It'd really be like that. <laughs> The music stopped. Thank goodness. The dude next to you would be blasting music until like 3 a.m. on a Tuesday. Yeah, I mean. With paper thin walls, I know. Yeah. Apartment living. Like college dorm living too. It's all loud and parties all the time. I hear every conversation, <laughs> every fight, every crying session. You had to wake up at 5 a.m. Did they wake you up, I'm assuming, through the night? All right, well, she's going to work in an hour. Um, I'm going to stop the stream here and start up next. I don't know if I'm streaming tomorrow, but um, 
Usually Saturdays are the days that I stream or can stream. I might randomly stream in the middle of the week. Who knows? It just depends. My fiance likes to stream a lot too. Um, so it just depends on that. But next stream we'll just start off by her going to work. Um, getting her actress level up. Earning her some more money. Well, she's already in love, so... Yippee! She's got... She's got Braylon. What's his channel you're looking for people to follow? Um, it is... Here, I'll put it in. Let's see... If I spell right. So this is his um, stream name. Um, sometimes we do actually Lately, I've been trying to stream some Stardew Valley with him. I don't know if you've ever seen that. Um, it's Koopa Troop is his channel. Um, we did that last week where he we played Stardew. I think we've got some plans this week, and so I'm not sure if we're um, doing that this weekend as well. But um, we could always decide that in the middle of the week, too. It's just whenever him and I get time to do that together. We have a weird schedule anyways to get a work around but um he streams i think like twice maybe three times a week so he does a lot of gaming with his friends and whatnot um but i will probably play more than likely next week saturday for sure um i might randomly come in and surprise people and play tomorrow or sometime in the middle of the week just depends whatever my schedule is like and whenever i feel like it it's got 94 followers. Uh, he might. <laughs> Sounds like something he does. Hello and welcome back to Monster Hunter. I don't know. He probably does. But yeah, um, that is it for the stream. Um, I will catch up with you guys later. I appreciate all the follows and the messages and making this game enjoyable to play with, with people watching. Um, if you haven't watched this, um, if you didn't get to watch most of this, I'll probably be uploading it to YouTube. But anyhow, thanks again, everybody, and I appreciate playing with you guys, and I will see you next time. Bye.